die. By the bell. Hello, everybody. I'm a Nick, and welcome back to Tales of Symphonia. Last time, Colette is going to be the chosen of regeneration. We gotta get her through this temple. Also, something I was looking through the menu real quick is the cooking system. I noticed that the game starts us with a couple pieces of bread. And we can choose who we want to make sandwiches. Apparently, Genius is really good at sandwich making, so... We'll have him make the sandwich. It's the only recipe we have right now. So choose who you want to cook, and then just press the X button. And we got a percentage of hit points back. Who'd thunk it? Was there a monster the whole time, or is this like random... Or whatever. Ow. I will also say, though, that, like, the, the game that I've played the most in the Tales of series is actually Tales of the Abyss. I'm literally at the final boss, and then I stopped playing. I don't know why, but I just did. I can't explain it. That's just how it is. Also, curious little me has to explore every little nook and cranny. Give them no quarter. I'm pushing the wrong button to actually throw out my demon fang. I would like to take on this spider thing, please. Thank you. Ow. Now I have a new tech. Oh, do I have to set it? I don't know what direction it's set to. Ooh, two apple gels. I'll take it. So yeah, when you have a new tech, you should really go to your menu and... S Why is that set to up? Set it there. Yeah, the more you use techs, it actually tracks, and that's actually how you learn spells and whatnot, so... Yeah, Kratos has spells, too. Keep that in mind. Let's get this over with. Combo time. Also, if you notice how certain moves have a way of pushing enemies around, take advantage of that. Back it up. Because you want to know what's better than uh, taking some damage? Taking no damage. There. I would like more of my TP back per fight, but I will take what I can get. Wait, if this is the way downstairs, then... Oh yeah, monsters will just spawn like that. You can throw, and Demon Fang is actually a really long-range strike, so you can throw that those out from far away. So that's nice. I hate that saying. I lose grade. Grade isn't a thing that will be taken into account until you beat the game. Oh yeah, we have to go get this thing called the Sorcerer's Ring. Before we can proceed, so I should have just went downstairs. Give them no quarter. Usually when an enemy guards, it's about to attack. Oh yeah, you can also jump. Although I mentioned that with uh, attacks you can hold up on the control stick for. Because we did fight an eagle. Really should have mentioned that. Surprise attacks aren't really a thing. Oh goodness. I keep. Why do I keep pushing the guard button when I'm trying to do a special. It would be nice not to keep rolling into that, you know? Oh, 
Okay, I'll fight you, I guess. What do you want? Bully the zombie! Bully the zombie! Basically, you can treat combat in this game as if, kind of as if it were a fighting game. Which is really cool. Oh, baloney. Why did I lose one singular minuscule thing of grade? Well, we found the sorcerer's ring. I bet that's the sorcerer's ring. Okay, let's go get it. Look, there's something here. Look out! All right, let's go. Ow. I will press this B button if I have to. <laughs> We're both throwing sonic thrusts out. Wow, it turned into a rock. Well, it was kind of a rock to begin with. Oops. Uh. Oh no. I get it. I see. What? What are you two talking about? In just a moment. It'll probably... See? There it is. Whoa! There's another one! Now let's take care of it and drop it down below. Yeah, we have to take care of these rock monsters. Ow. Well, it's dead now. I'll take it. I will also take level ups. That's nice, too. See? Oh, it's a rock. Or it's a block, and we can push it around. Everybody loves their light puzzle solving elements. Woohoo! Push it down the hole, and there you go. I think that's just another entryway. Hmm, I'm conf I'm I'm curious about that one part. What was that shimmy? Yeah, it's not stunned by that. Back it up, back it up. There we go. Gotcha, fool. Okay, we do have another way of doing that. I see. But if I want to do that, we need to make one more of them spawn. Because I have to fix this up. Oh, we have two ways to go. You're telling me I have to kill two more? In order to fill up all the passageways? Well, I'll play that game. Ow. Well, that happened. There. Well, I guess with that, we can now push these blocks into the appropriate spots. If there isn't anything worth it over there, then I'ma just be like, what did I do this for? Oh, there is definitely treasure here. It's worth it. Ow. We don't have free run in this game. That was until Tales of the Abyss. I'm like, where's my free run button? Where's my free run button? And the magic lens is an item you can use to uh, check an enemy's stats. 
And also how much maximum HP they have left, too. So that's their maximum current HP. I can't speak with beans. Give them no quarter. Come on, attack. And you did the attack I can't stun you out of. Apparently I can't stun anything worth beans, but I'm doing okay. I'm doing just fine. I want all the treasure in this place before I go grab the sorcerer's ring, because why not? Why not? And maybe fight one more loon, because why not? That, did that ghost just throw a hammer? That just looks funny. No, you don't. I want my TP back, you f Ooh, more bottles. Panacea bottles restore statuses. Speak of the devil. For real, though, let's... Oh, we needed one more block. You bad. Oh, there's also a safe circle here. How convenient. Alright, guess I got one more to do, huh? Give them no quarter. Demon fang. Demon fang. Then I'll just throw demon fangs at you, because why not? Oh, come on! That's what I get for not paying attention to hitboxes. Yellow quartz? What the hell is that? Uh, I said items? Mmm, weird. Probably for, like, weapon stuff later. I don't need to take care of that now, though. So... So this is the Sorcerer's Ring! I've heard about it before. It's a holy artifact of the Church of Martell! We should be able to deal with most traps and obstacles with this. Wow, let me try it! Okay, Lloyd. Such a little kid. X button! Oh, it was just the camera change. Anywho, it shoots this little particle effect out. Which is kind of nice. Oh, there are monsters over here, too. When I just wanted to save. Well, aren't you a punk? Speaking of punks, Spider Punk! Ow. Why don't you take a little bit of that? And if I could keep stocking up on those apple gels, that'd be great. Or as many as I'm allowed to hold. I might as... I was uh, trying to target Genus, but apparently I can't do jack shit. Per usual, saving in multiple slots. Because now I'm just trained to do. Oh god, they're everywhere. They're after my butt. They want my booty hole. One right after another. Take some of this and this. Hey, maybe. Oh god, I'm being comboed, and I can't aim and attack the right way with beans. Yeah, how about that? Now, will you let me go up these stairs so I can see what's over here? Because that's just a monster. That's a monster who wants my butthole. Is that what you want? Oh, you want some of this? Well, that's done. Enemies deserve no mercy. Everybody okay? Yeah, but why are there so many monsters in the temple? 
This is part of the Chosen's trial. Weren't you aware of that when you decided to join her? Of course I knew that. I'm sorry, it's my fault you're here. Don't worry about it, it's for the sake of bringing peace to the world. Dwarven vow number one, right? I told you to stop bringing those up. Apple gel. Life bottle. 250 gold. It's not gold. It's gold. The gall. The gall. But I'll take all your loot anyway. I think there was an another purpose uh, of the sorcerer's ring. Is you can stun monsters if you don't want to fight. Or the, the, the you just can't respond in time anyway. Because why not? This. Some of that. Maybe some of this too. Why not? Said, back it up. Back it up. You picked the wrong guy to mess with. Exactly. Oh, of course, my sorcerer's ring burst comes out after the fact. There it goes. Now you let me through. Oh, is this all the sorcerer's ring does? You get bored so easily. Teleport! This appears to be the top floor. Yes, that's the altar. Then that shining thing there must be the Crucius Crystal. That's right. They say I was born with that in my hand. Look at that light! Is that an angel I would assume so is that Colette's real father I am Remiel I am an angel of judgment I am here to guide Colette daughter of the mana lineage on her journey to heaven as the seventh chosen Time has come to awaken the goddess Martell, who sleeps at the center of the world. Awaken the goddess Martell? It's just like the legend Rain told us about! From this moment, Colette becomes the Chosen of Regeneration. We of Crucius bless this event, and hereby bestow the Tower of Salvation upon Silverant. So that's the Tower of Salvation. Now the world will be saved! Colette, the Chosen of Regeneration. Unlock the seals that guard the Tower of Salvation and climb its stairs to heaven in distant lands. I humbly accept this task. Very good. We of Crucius shall grant you the power of the angels with each seal you unlock. Once you are reborn as an angel, this eroded world shall be regenerated. Thank you. I swear on my life I will regenerate the world. First, head south 
to the seal of fire. Offer your prayers in that distant land. Yes, Lord Remiel. Oh, wait. Please wait. I have a question I wish to ask of you. Are you really my fa- First, head to the seal of fire. Understood, my beloved daughter Colette. F father So you really are my true father. We shall meet again at the next seal. I can't believe Remuel is my father. I'm alright. I'm just a little surprised, that's all. So that was the Oracle. I wish Rain could have seen him. Colette must now go on a long journey to search for those seals. You've received the Oracle. Then let us leave now, Chosen. Oh, yes. We're going on ahead. Um, thank you, both of you. Please stop by my house later. She left. The rumor was true. What rumor? That Colette is the daughter of an angel not really related to her current father. Even if you're not related by blood, family is family. At least that's what I think. I, I'm sorry. Hey, don't worry about it. And with that, it's now just Genus and Lloyd. So angels really do have wings. Yeah, just like in the scriptures at the Church of Martell. But you know, it's a hassle when they have to change our clothes. Huh? I, I guess so. And you have to make holes in your clothes for the wings to go through, too. Have you been thinking about this the whole time, Lloyd? Well, yeah, I mean, aren't you curious? I wonder if they'll get in the way when they sleep. Being an angel is pretty inconvenient, huh? I suppose so. <laughs> Banter. Marvelous! Professor? What are you two doing here? You're supposed to be studying in class! Uh, uh-oh... Rain, I I'm sorry! You're next, Lloyd! Are you ready? Whoa, no! Hey, stop! Now, you two, if you've learned your lesson, go back home. There will be no class for the rest of the day. What about you? I've received permission from Phydra to study this temple a little while longer. It's not often that ordinary citizens have the opportunity to enter this place. <laughs> Luckily, ass whooping doesn't actually decrease your HP. <laughs> what was that? You're better off not knowing. Let's just leave, shall we? What's Colette going to do now? That angel told her to release the seals. Then she'll become an angel. So Colette's going to leave the village. I think that's probably enough excitement for now. So, on today's episode of Tales of Symphonia, Colette is now going to become an angel. Also, we got the sorcerer's ring, I guess. And for the time being, we were told to just go back to the village. 
which is what we're going to do next time. So with that, I'm Nick, and I'll see you guys next time.